you're watching 8-bit days a week and um, as of this recording actually it's about um, 24 hours before the release of the new version of the bleem sync so for this video I'll just be playing some Street Fighter movie the game the arcade version this didn't have any console version well the console version was uh, wildly different from uh, the arcade version because on the console version it had like uh, some sort of story mode and the gameplay is much like Super Turbo Street Fighter 2 so it's uh, quite different so as you can see performance isn't really that good but it's playable it's uh, locked there at the 54 to 55 frames per second it's not your perfect but as I mentioned it's at least playable compared to let's say the I mean, sorry, playing the game on the Super NES, uh, Super NES Classic. And, um, yeah, I guess I just needed, like, an excuse to play this game again. Because, uh, the last time I played this, really, like, I really played it in the arcade. That's like how many years ago? Because <laughs> this didn't have any... Like I mentioned, this didn't have any console version. And uh, I always... Um, like the craziness to it. It's broken, yes. The combo system is whack. And the difficulty is actually insane. <laughs> there are some cheese moves you can do. Like I know people do the guile, uh, roundhouse, down roundhouse, down roundhouse. And it will go over and over until they die. Or Vega's juggle with the claw. And you'll actually get far with the game. So yeah, uh, apologies if I haven't um, made more videos about uh, PS1 or PSP games running on the classic but yeah I'm, I'm, I'm really waiting for the version one because um, I'm just thinking there might be some performance differences so any playtest I make may not be an accurate representation or outdated at least And I was looking at their website, they have that timer thing, it's coming out in exactly 24 hours as of this recording I'm doing right now. And I'm just messing around right, the, messing around right now with this game. As you can see, they have the Mortal Kombat style of graphics digitized. And I don't believe those are actual the actual actors from the movie. Are they? I really don't know. 
they're lookalikes, it's really good lookalikes, I guess. And the movie was... Um, it's actually fun. Don't expect something uh, like, like a masterpiece. It's not even perfect. The fight scenes are not that good. But I suppose there's a certain charm to it. So bad it's so good kind of thing. Just don't take it seriously and you can actually enjoy it. Seems like there's a Mortal Kombat fatality going there <laughs> on the background. So I wish I could use my joystick on this game, of course, but... Uh, it's not working. My stick, at least. I think if you have like a PlayStation 4 joystick, that should work on RetroArc. Because on RetroArc, at least, uh, PlayStation 4 controllers work. I can confirm that. Just plug in. Well, on the USB and you shouldn't have any problems. So if you need your analogs, say if you loaded some game that required analog like Ape Escape, I think that should do. Um. Vega versus ten. Round one. Fight. Sure, how was that they do? They just... No, it's this one. It's juggle all day. If I could get it to work. Well, I guess it's not that simple. Die there. So is it weird that I find uh, later games much much easier than this one? But no, wait. Uh, I played the PS1 version, and although it plays like Super Turbo, the AI there is also insanely hard. <laughs> Uh. 
<laughs> this game's really hard. Oh, well. I think I'm not using actual credits. Oh, the joys of having Mame. I'll try Bison. Bison versus Saga. Round one. Fight. How do you do that electric thing he did in the movie? Crusher is uh what the what was that? <laughs> Torpedo is a fireball motion actually. That's funny. Oh wait, was it? It's not working now. Alright, let's see. I'll try Chun Li versus the guy. Chun Li. Street Fighter games, Third Strike in particular, also in Super Turbo, I guess. Finish this game before I lose my mind. And we have here one of the original characters made for the game, but uh, I guess based, but, uh, based from someone in the movie, along with uh, Sawada. Survive in this game, find your cheap attack and just repeatedly spam it. If you play it, uh, if you let play it honestly, <laughs> I don't know how far you'll get through this game before losing your mind. Does it take long? Oh, I didn't know you can. Or is that the Sawada guy? Thank <laughs> you. 
I see some frame drops there. Jenny, the thing is, if you didn't really play this game back in the arcade, you wouldn't know the difference on the speed. Smash lately. Not having much luck though. Still do this. That's insane. I'm almost having feels like having flashbacks uh, during. When was it super... Super Street Fighter 4. I'm thinking which version, but um, like everyone was playing, like everyone was playing Kami. <laughs> it was uh, insane. Like Guile's cheese move won't work on her. Choose. I will try Ryu. Oh, actually, I'll try Akuma. Akuma wasn't in the movie. Akuma versus Kami. I got hit with a super and I'm still dizzy. Oh, 
Well, Akuma is fun, but um, obviously I'm not good enough. I'll try Sagat. Sagat versus Kami. Who barely fought in the movie, I guess. We just fought uh, Ken once. Couldn't even been Ryu instead. to be a joke now um why don't i try cammy herself Cammy versus Cammy. What? which one, one am i the losing one i guess Hey, face there. <laughs> oh. oh, come on, the super didn't come out. Oh, at least I still won that one. That grab. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try Ryu. Ryu I'm sorry, Ryu. The heck is he saying? Sawada, new character. No idea what her move, what his moves are. Okay, he has a sword. Oh. Kinda like 
Adon's Jaguar 2 stream. Oh! Alright. Maybe I could still do this. I guess I'm thankful we had this game because now, I mean, we, we have an idea how Street Fighter would look like, almost, almost in real life. And it doesn't really translate well. As you can see here, if your proportions are realistic, actually look goofy. Not the dog. Whoa. Back then, this is one of the few games where you can actually play Akuma. Is, um, I mean Akuma is a regular character that is, is usually like a hidden one. It was hidden in Super Turbo, Alpha, and um, X-Men, Children of the Atom. Eventually he got he can be unlocked in EX, Free Fighter EX. He was uh, crazy good in that game. There goes my hurricane kick spamming. Now let's see if I can use Chun Li against Akuma. Chun Li versus Akuma. Round one. Time over. Uh, that can't be right. Or a master of 
fist, he kind of runs away so much. Okay, okay, who could I use? I'll try Vega. actually adjusted to well I've been spamming the same move over and over oh, come on I just want to finish this game actually just passing time isn't Raul Julia. Kidding me. <laughs> okay, okay. Let's go with the poster boy. Oh, wait, Guile is the poster boy <laughs> in this version at least. See, that's the insane juggling that I actually like in this game. Almost 
sounds like the Rainbow Editions of uh, Champion Edition before. There was this very specific Rainbow Edition that I'm actually looking for. The one where Ryu can throw two fireballs at once, goes up and down. And uh, Zangief spinning clothesline has a uh, yoga flame by his legs. Sonic, uh, Guile Sonic Boom goes kind of motions going up and down. That's the specific one that I actually played in the arcade, so for nostalgic purposes, I'm looking for it. But I, I think I went over each ROM variant of uh, Super uh, Champion Edition. I can't really find it. If anyone knows what version that is, please let me know in the comments. What the heck was that? That wasn't a fireball. Alright, Chun-Li doesn't work. I'll try a Kuma again. Akuma versus Bison! Seriously, this game is hard. We've got a really unpredictable AI here. Alright, I started this game with Ken. Let's see if I can end it with Ken. Ken versus Bison. Round one. Even saying Bragar, Bagar, Bragar. One more time. him there. Oh, too far. <laughs> what was I thinking? That's just insane. You got hit with a super and you're still dizzy after.
<laughs> alright, alright, alright. I can do this. I'll try Chun Li. I mean, Cammy. This time. Cammy! Look at that damage! closest I got to winning was Vega. So let me just spam my claws again. Ugh. Feel it. This is the winning round. Great. All right. Finally, let's see some endings. This is honestly the first time I've beaten this game. Okay. Um, okay. Better than nothing, I guess. I did not expect that one, <laughs> but yeah, he's right, game over. Alright, I suppose that's it for this video. Um, my next few videos will probably be back to trying out uh, PlayStation 1 uh, or PlayStation Portable games if there is uh, improvements. But this is also to show that arcade games uh, work fine in the PS Classic. In fact, they, some of them, like this one, work better than using the SNES Classic. Because um, Street Fighter movie was definitely not playable. It's too slow if you load the arcade ROM there. And even this one is not perfect on the PlayStation Classic. So who knows? We need something more powerful, I guess. Well, looks like that's it. And uh, all right, you're watching 8-Bit Days a Week. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And see you in the next few videos Hopefully the new Bleem Sync version will be out.